Okay, so I've just woken up, literally, as you can tell, I'm like half naked. Um, Dan gets back and he comes with like some dry ass fucking tobacco from Andy, which I told him not to get. And then he's like, I'm like, well, why are you staring at me? And he's like, I'm just waiting. I'm like, waiting for what? Well, an apology. I'm like, wait for an apology, mate. I'm not gonna smoke your gross dry tobacco, and you didn't get me any beer. My bong is broken, so you didn't do anything for me. So he starts shouting at me like, run, 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 run. I'm not even fucking joking. He does this to me all the time. It's so abusive, but at the same time, it's not abusive because he just sounds like a fucking idiot when he does it. And um, He's shouting, and I said, I didn't shout at you. I don't shout at you like that, you crazy person. And he's just like leaving, like to go out of the house and I don't know, be a cock for hours. Fuck knows, it's a little shit. And I just go, oh wait, no, what does he say? He says, because you're always treating me like shit. And I said, well, he didn't say that calmly, but you wouldn't understand it. That's what it is. And I was just like, that's because you are shit. And then he starts shouting like fucking crazy, slamming the doors, screaming up and down the road. Like, what is this? Did his dad shout at him like this? Like, I never heard his dad shout like that. And his mom certainly can't shout. So, yeah, abusive. Just as I told him, I had like a really good dream about him as well. And then his nastiness reminded me that the good dream was actually a bad dream. That there was two and one Dan was really abusive and one was really nice. But the other Dan treated me like Dan has never ever treated me ever in my whole life. What a shame. You know, that was the thing I was really upset about in the dream. Is that I'd never had a boyfriend that actually treated me nicely. Until that dream Dan, he wasn't Dan. Back into the kitchen and as you can tell we are... <sighs> And yeah, so like, today, people watch this, they'll probably be like, oh, I'd be a great boyfriend. Living in proximity so to someone, 24 hours of the day, and as you just saw, it's difficult. I'm simply just using a tiny bit of fairy liquid, and I also do spray them with some method cleaner, just because it's I think that it makes them a lot more shinier. Oh, but I do have an update, I got myself a tattoo, I think I'll upload my tattoo video of my tattooing myself. Wait, eat, 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 eat. How do I make it out? Yeah. It's a cat. I did it myself. And I'm working on a tattoo from Dan, for, for Dan. But he's so much of a fucking pussy. He cannot take it. He wanted his first tattoo on his inner arm. Devil driver symbol. Three sessions already. I've only just managed to outline and map where the fucking sharp points are. Like, you're shit, Dan. You're such a puss.